Hey there, welcome back everybody. This time we're going to be doing a strain review. I know I haven't done that in a little while, but I got gifted something really, really dank and I wanted to show you guys. Um, this is some of the best hash that I've smoked in a long while. I actually got gifted another little piece of this and I was supposed to, or I was going to put it on the show, but I ended up trying it and it was so dank I just had to smoke it all. So I got some more and this time I'm going to do it immediately as, as soon as I got it. But it is uh, the Deadhead OG. Um, it's bubble hash and it's made by my buddy Bubble Modes here and he is just killing it. This is, again, I'm super impressed with the quality um, of this hash. So let's get into it. Um, obviously he's got a cool little sticker I really like for just this particular hash. It's got the Grateful Dead skull on it. That's kind of cool. He's got it labeled nice. Deadhead OG 6 star bubble hash. Let me see. Right, I need a little piece of parchment. nice little pre-cuts that I got from Black Label Company. Shout out to Black Label Company. Let's see here. So I mean the first thing about this stuff is obviously the the aroma. Mmm. God the, the smell coming off of this is just obscene. And look at that consistency. This also impresses me because uh, Bubble Modes is a siever, which I do not do, but look at how tiny and blonde this is. And he sieves this stuff. So I, I'm usually microplaning to get that kind of consistency and, and as a matter of fact that kind of color and he's got it just I mean it's white and it's just tiny little pieces he's doing an excellent job sieving um, I could see myself uh, sieving with this technique if this was the result that it got so good job for that I'm super impressed with this hash Get a little hit out here. Talk about it some more. It smells like just some straight lemons. It's got a really lemony citrus aroma. Let's stick into that too. Maybe that, that's from the sift. Really, really light white color. I mean. Dude, I cannot get over how white this is. It just looks like some straight sift. Killing it. Killing it with the gold blonde deadhead hash. Um, I don't know if this is dropped yet at the shop, but it will soon, I imagine. If you see this on his Instagram feed, do not sleep on it. It's going to go quick, and I promise you it's worth it. Give this a little finger press. Get the higher hair iron warmed up. <laughs> yeah, real strong flavor. Got real tiny sieve pieces. I might actually give that a try next time. Still got my trusty little blue mini. Just like that. You can see completely through it. Even through two pieces of parchment.
Oh, God, it smells so good. Yeah, this, this strain on Betsy. There we go. Look at that. Just look at that. That's just killer. I mean, it's it couldn't be lighter in color. It just is absolutely amazing. This for shits and giggles. That's not even glossy. If I let it sit out to where it got glossy, this thing would be completely see-through. It's a little matted from the press, but... You get the idea. She's clear as clear can be. I super love this stuff. Excited to have another jar of it. Definitely after this hit, I'm probably going to just stash it away for a rainy day or until I think about it again. Um, I actually might actually go swoop some more of this myself up. Alright, this stuff is really stable. Nice dry he's got going on on it. There we go. Just not wanting to let go. And we're gonna go hard on this. It's my first hit of the day. Should get nice and baked. I don't wanna paint my mouth with these deadhead terps. Alright. So we got that deadhead OG ready. Let's go ahead and get this thing out. I just changed the water on this thing. So should be nice. I don't know how you guys would see it like that. Something like that. Alright. A little bit of breathing started off. Get a good amount of oxygen in my lungs so I can hold my breath. Cheers. <laughs> oh, this is massive. <laughs> massive. Oh, the terps. The terp retention on this strain. Absolutely phenomenal. Tastes ten times stronger than it smells. <laughs> My 
my goodness. Great job, Bubble Modes. Um, this is by far the best hash run I've ever tried of yours. Keep up the great work, man. You're an inspiration. For sure. Killing it. Oh, man. Those lemon terps just still rushing over me. A little bit of the sweats. That was a pretty fatty. <coughs> oh, that melt looked pretty gnarly too. Might actually put that up on Instagram. That was a badass melt. Uh, wow. We've got a few other projects coming up. I'm actually going to go out and uh, press some flour with the hard press. Uh, I don't know, I might take a video out there while I'm doing it, but I'm not planning on, uh, you know, doing a whole video on this. I kind of got a lot of work to do today, and I don't want to have to worry about uh, the camera work. I just want to get this stuff done. When I have something smaller, which I have some, a couple of ounces of a few different strains that I just want to taste in rosin form. When I'm just doing that for my own personal use, I'll definitely pick up the camera and, uh, you know, take it out there to the sift room with me and we'll do that. So, yeah, by the way, I don't know if you guys caught that on the last video too, that the hard press is, uh, um, I mean, is stationed in the sift room. So that was the sift room that we were working in last time, the all white room. So that was kind of cool. <clears throat> I'm still trying to hang a couple things up, like that warranty from it and stuff. I, I do want, and when I do some sift in there, I'll I'll take the camera in there too. We'll, we'll do a good panorama. Um, this is some sift that I've been working on uh, lately. This is the Chernobyl. Uh, I know you guys have seen the flowers if you followed along for a while. Kind of catching the light wrong. It's definitely a little bit lighter than that's popping up on camera, but it's dank. Uh, I mean, I could definitely a six star melt, uh, but that's uh, I don't know if you follow me or Bubble Modes on Instagram. <clears throat> that's what we've been smoking on. I just gifted him some of that last night, and he was digging on it. He took a couple pictures of it. And this was what we were supposed to smoke, but we got interrupted, so I just brought it back home. And I'm going to smoke it today. <laughs> but I'm going to definitely enjoy the buzz that was from this first. <coughs> Super killer. Yeah. Uh, my top five favorite hashes. This would, this would definitely make it in there. Give it a chance. You won't regret it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time.